Hello, sorry guys. Actually, I don't know these settings and all the things. Automatically, the live got disconnected. And again, 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 I started this one live. Yeah, blessing in this guys. Yeah, hi. Rakshit. Yeah, hi. So you people not able to hear my voice? Is it? Are you able to hear me? Is it audible? My voice? Things and all things automatically. Yeah, go over then ready. Hi. Sadas, you yeah, okay, fine, yeah. So fine. So excuse me, please, uh, please excuse me. So for the first time live, right? So that is the reason. Uh, so next time onwards, I will try to maintain these all things, settings and all those things. So is there any questions means you can ask me. Yeah, go over the netting. Hi, bro. I am fine. So, what are the courses you are you are plan uh, that you are uh, seeing right now in my YouTube playlist? Okay, DevOps thing means uh, please do videos on DevOps. DevOps thing, so something like Kubernetes. Uh, I have a plan, but I need to do so. I don't have that much of experience on the Kubernetes, but I have an idea on AWS. These all things I have an idea. But uh, most of the things I am targeting on the front end, as I am the team lead in the front end development, front end wing, everything is handled by me in my company. So that is the reason I first I am targeting about this front end thing only. Afterwards, I will. Uh, uh, so my plan is there. So regarding this one. In javascript i will start uh, mongodb node.js regarding the backend so that in one language javascript we will be able to do both the front end and backend and afterwards i will start the devops thing so how to azure uh, aws kubernetes these all things docker these all things also we'll discuss so a lot of time a lot of time is there so we need to do so many videos are there actually we'll do it mc can check can you explain your youtube journey Nothing much bro actually YouTube journey I am I am normally a developer so working on my own so when this covid came so I thought of uh, what to do so in home I am doing right work from home so in the work from home I thought that why can't my I can't I share my knowledge so like that I thought so I started sharing my language uh, knowledge in this YouTube that's the only thing so nothing nothing more uh, reason behind the starting the YouTube so just because of the covid i am in working home so rather than staying in the home so let's do some other thing so that uh, we can have experience and uh, that too also so I, I can improve my communication language so that i can know how much knowledge i am having so that how much the people are able to understand my thing so what i am trying to explain so is the people can able to understand or not slowly i am also improving so my uh, my fault and all those things is also there so I will try to improve. So improving, improving daily by daily. That's the main thing. Yeah, thank you. So go then ready watching Angular and JavaScript. See, Angular is the thing. So a lot of things I have covered in the Angular courses. So please try to read the. Please try to. Um, please try to see these Angular videos. Something like NGRX. We have we have did the NGRX thing. Unit testing also I have did. So, so many people have uh, doubts in the unit testing. So, they don't know. The people who come to the floor and working in the real time. So, they don't know about this, uh, what I can say, unit testing. So, I have did so many uh, unit testing videos. I have covered all the concepts. So, if you want means you can see those things also. So, sir, you are in which company? Actually, I am working in Hyderabad based company, Qualmines. Thank <laughs> you. 
yeah yeah so i will do it sure sure i will do it when this angular best practices and all those things are completed so our target is uh, so what i was planning was i don't want to take much of things so for example let's say that some i will not go out of the javascript something like what i can say is i will not do the php first i started the php class only then afterwards i realized so i took the only one language that is javascript i want to cover everything in the javascript so that's it i don't i don't i will not go to dot net core or something like that i will not cover those type of videos will not be there in our channel only the javascript so everything javascript from top to bottom it will be there in our uh, what i can say in our channel so that is the only thing so these spinners uh, these all rich editors integration these all things also i will do it uh, sure i will do it when our uh, what i can say our courses and all those things are completed so many people are there actually what i can say is uh, they don't know how to how to work on the angular the best practices when they go into the company they don't know these all the things so for that reason i am doing sir i am front end developer with 15 months of experience should i try to switch now or after having at least 2 years experience that depends actually uh, 15 months late uh, sorry it's already 15 months right so seven months till more you you work means you will get two years of experience so better complete two years of experience if you have any problem in the company or anything means so you can uh, you can you can switch it so if any nothing problem is there means it's okay it's a salary constraint so many things will be there because that's your personal thing right i cannot ask tell you to switch the company but that depends on you if you want to switch and all those things if you want to have a bright future if it is not there in that company means you can switch it not a problem but try to maintain the consistency in a company so that is the suggestion i can give you why because so you if you develop the domain knowledge or the project knowledge in the company so the company itself will find so much of weightage for you so that is the thing i can suggest switching on going on the company there are, what i can say is coding wise you, you can improve but uh, what i can say is uh, the project domain so for example let's say that i am working in automobile uh, based project so everything regarding the automobile and all those things the com the project a uh, uh, top and bottom and everything i know about that one the client will give so much of weightage for me so if you want to add a requirement or anything means the client will take suggestion from me so that type of weightage you need to get in the company so then automatically you can do it. try to create unit testing use just also yeah sure sure i will make uh, this one so i'm completing after completing this jasmine and all those things i will try to do it any plans for micro front ends in react yeah yeah i yeah, we i have a plans so i need to do it average salary for full stack web development in india see these days i am able to i am interviewing some of the guys in from the front end development so itself Three years, four years experience. Also, they are asking nearly about ten lakhs, more than ten lakhs. Depends on their thing. So, ten lakhs is the average thing. Three years experience they are getting in the full in the front end development itself. In the full stack also, let's say let's assume that ten lakhs something like that. So, this has been for five, five years experience. We are getting around sixteen uh, lakhs something like that. If the candidate has uh, full stuff enough, so you can get up to fifteen sixteen lakhs. It's not a problem. That you must have a stuff. You must have a why because when you get in the floor. so all the eyes will be on you only so that is the thing you need to understand so if you are taking 15 lakhs 16 lakhs and you are sitting on the floor so uh, that content also that knowledge the knowledge also that you are uh, that you are having is also very important so that is the thing you need to remember in your mind so always you need to improve the language uh, sorry improve the knowledge that's what i can tell you i am 5 months old angular developer i think i am very bad at angular how to improve just practice my ank so my ank sati so practice is the main thing so previously when i started i am also too bad in the angular so that is the thing i can tell you so just practicing makes you perfect that is the thing i can suggest you so watch my videos every video uh, try to practice uh, read other articles and all those things just try to do it i watched your videos i just please reference even i am from ux background i can easily understand your videos now i got content to convert your design to your yeah sure sada so yeah you can you can convert it's not a problem everyone can convert so if you have two years of experience just practice and just try it not a problem as ux designer keep the ux designer background experience and you can try for your developer not a not a problem you can get the chance bro if you doing any uh, so i'm interested to do uh, i am not doing any freelance work bro so i am unable today it's why because i have lot of things to do 
Okay. Micro front end using Angular. Yeah, sure, bro. We'll do it, MMC. Actually, right now I'm doing HTML course, right? So HTML course, I'm trying to finish it off very quickly. And I will start the CSS. Why? Because I started HTML CSS. Some people are asking me, some, some newcomers are asking me, some newcomers are asking me about this, uh, what I can say, mm, about this courses. Yeah. Yeah, next JS tutorial. See, I should, bro. I will do it. The React JS, next JS, right? So I will try to do it. Yeah. Cypress Sai Kumar. Uh, it's uh, not comes under UT unit testing, right? It comes under end to end testing. End to Cypress. <laughs> yeah, he's kicking back. Yeah. Yeah. Go over then. Yeah, I'm staying in Hyderabad only. Yeah, he is my son. So it's not not son. Sir. Sorry, he, he it's a daughter. So I would like to learn about CA CD for Angular or SPA. Is there any plan for it? so right now no plans bro so future we may we can do it yeah thank you my try to see those declarative reactive programming course also it is also very much important and uh, having so much of deep understanding so those things also very important so if you are having gaining more experience means try to see those courses also maybe you may get bored or something like that but those are important so if you try to see the video each video might be you have uh, you can learn one concept in that one so that is the thing is there any APS other than firebug for practice authentication exercises so other APS means so I will be using this firebase only not firebug firebase only but when we complete our node.js classes and all those things we will try to set up our own local uh, apis like that we'll do it so i thought of uh, doing like that but in uh, so node.js is not completed right so if i directly write the code in the node and all those things people will get confused so that is the reason i have used sir have you read you don't know no, no, I haven't read that one. Go over the nitty. Can we learn both React and Angular? Yeah, why can't we can do it? Not a problem. Design patterns in JavaScript. Yeah, that is also in my mind actually. I will try to do it. Design patterns also. Best practices and in Angular also I will try to do architecture and the best practices. How in the real time application the Angular we will be planning the application and all those things we'll try to see. Yeah. Okay. Sir, are you working as an Angular developer? My uncle. Yeah, I am working as an uh, actually so, uh, team lead. So there are 18 members of the front end developer working under me. So we will be working on React. Angular and also Vue.js also will be working. Each one is best React are you? I personally don't like the React so much, but React is very much famous. 
why i don't like is so writing the html in the javascript for me very much uh, confusing if you want to write the class you need to write it as class name like this uh, you will be having something so the traditional way of writing the code so we need to change when we want to write it in the react but i i don't say that uh, but i don't say that react is not best personally what i will feel is the react writing the react means so writing the html in the javascript so this one will uh, will look for me a little bit of new and all those things so that's why personally whereas the view and angular are same so they will be having the division of the template so that we can write the html what we have learned since long back whereas in the react when we try to write the html some concepts will be there which we need to learn jsx syntax and all the things we need to learn so like this so uh, react also very nice which one is best reactor view means so view will be somewhat easier so if you try to see view will be easier react is also easier only so these both are easier only uh, compared to angular and all those things so view is a little bit of view if you have angular experience view will find it very easily why because in angular you will have ng for uh, what i can say in in view you will be having v for whereas in react you don't have those all things you will be using this for loop and all those things whereas in this uh, what i can say ng if we if like this angular and view have somewhat uh, uh, close relation with each other whereas react is entirely different that writing the html in the javascript that is thing. how to manage git for the team so what is there how to manage the git for the team so you will be creating the branches everyone will raise the pr and all those things you will be having it mono repos any plans for mono repos no bro so i need to check those things which is having more value angular or react but depends go over the night to I, I, I too cannot say so actually in the market right now react is more popular angular also is somewhat popular only so one one thing what i can say is, is try to learn whatever the react or angular whichever you are trying to learn learn it perfectly that is the that is the thing i can tell you so as a front end developer so if you learn perfectly the angular or react including the best practices architecture designs everything so whatever the things present in this if you try to learn another what i can say another front end framework is very easy for you it will look very easily within one month or one and a half month you can cope up with that one so it's not a problem so both has the value angular or react which so but you need to learn the perfectly so if you learn somewhat half in the angular and you shift to uh, react you'll find difficult Yeah, the things what uh, uh, I want to learn Angular like working real time project in corporate. Any roadmap, please uh, suggest. Yeah, I have already explained, right? So the Angular uh, Angular course, and I have already to, uh, uh, did the course in NGRX and the declarative reactive programming. So these are the main concepts. In the real time only, we will be working on these things. So combining these all the features, we will work in the real time. So if you understand those concepts and try to do the project in your own. So you can do it. So we will try to do a, a real time project in our Angular also. Your Angular tutorials are best aligned from it. Thank you. Thank you, Vijay. Yeah. So more I, in my company, I will be working more on the Angular and Vue.js actually. React is little bit only we will be working. Mm, Vue.js for the multi-page application will be working on the Vue.js for Angular for single page admin side we will be working okay I will learn bro but you should provide provide me a tutorial and other architecture indication sure sure I will be providing so whatever whatever the things I have the knowledge I will be sharing so that way I will be doing most possibly I was working something like I was doing daily two videos so I will do all the time. Any course I will be doing. So not a problem. Oh, blessing. Which which company are you blessing in this, guys? So your company, your NGRX courses. Pranay Kumar, what is the React JS pressure salary? Pressure salary. So that depends the company. So the company selection. They will be asking you the bond and all those things. The company norms, how it will be, the pressure they will be taking. So normally they will ask something around i don't know i don't know 25,000 or three years bond so like this they will be having the depends i don't know the pressure the company wants senior means i can tell the market how much it is there keep doing same thing you and angler are similar thank you we need the money 
mind tree okay in mind tree they are uh, it's a very it's very happy for me actually so some company are suggesting me my courses and all the things schematics uh, vijay sir create some videos and angular schematics yeah yeah actually i have plans with vijay so doing angular schematics and also angular elements also i will try to plan this angular elements course also actually i have in my mind i need to do it mayang sethi as a fresher i got 4.5 yeah it's awesome so nice mayang over the present i am working in angular in suti soft Patrick Basia, hello Lila. What are the benefits using Angular instead of React? Nothing benefit will be there. For, frankly saying, what I can say is, Angular is a full-fledged framework. Everything will be integrated in the Angular. That is the thing I can say. That if you want uh, routing, everything is, uh, is, is predefined. In forms and all those things, handling the forms in Angular is a different way. So it is a new way. So if you are coming from HTML, CSS, jQuery, JavaScript background, so if you are long back, suddenly learning the Angular will become a nightmare. Why? Because the forms, handling of these template-driven forms, React to forms, these are different. Whereas in the React, it is straightforward. So HTML form taking the form and all those things are very straightforward. Whereas React is a library, right? Everything you need to have the plugin play and all things. Angular is a framework, so it has a vast support. Both of them has a vast support. So benefits means uh, both are same. See, see, for example, let's say that Angular has some advantages and where React lacks out means React will not be there in the market. So both has the things. So everything will be solved using the Angular or React. Everything we can do it. So if, if some if one thing cannot be done by one library means it will fade out from the market so that's what i can i know about this one i can understand so angular has the capability to do all the things whereas the react also has the capability to do all the things only if one of the thing is not, unable to do by one library means so market means it will go away from the market rxjs course also manohar yeah thanks for reminding me yeah. rxjs course also is very important for angular developers who are uh, seeing so those things also so many people i'm able to know that they, they are unable to understand the difference between a subject and an observable so many people know so many people so having senior seniors i'm able to see they don't know the difference between subject and observable sometimes they don't know the difference between observable and a promise also so that is a thing you people have to remember Pravinandan Mahajan, I am trying to learn React JS. My friend gave you a URL. I am starting it. Could you please make a depth video on rendering process? Is it need to study both class and functional components? Yeah, actually, so class components and functional components is it necessary only? Why? Because the React JS team has told that they are not going to deprecate in the near future. Also, these class components uh, declaring the components in the class so i can suggest you that learning the class uh, having the knowledge of this creating class components is uh, somewhat important only not important it's necessary something like that you need to learn but most of the time we will start using the functional components only. that's not a problem can you teach about high level folder structure for enterprise yeah sure sure i will uh, regan boss sure sure i will do this one so next uh, next my target is that those things only angular only so i will do high level angular courses so coming on i will do these all things folder structure course shade yeah these all things i will do it not a problem architecture and the best practice i will do it. okay okay fine blessing actually they gave first gave plural set then they suggested yours and really liked it yeah okay thank you sai kumar same for me bro but your ngrx is recommended from my tl thank you sai kumar yeah this gives me somewhat boost up for me to do more videos. Ajifa Mangra. Usually along with Angular, many job requirements are with .NET or Java. Can anyone, can one only learn at Angular or learning with .NET or Java for backend side is a must. That depends. Uh, so if you are working, if you want to get the job or if you are doing as a full stack developer means, so a .NET core along with Java, so you will become a full stack developer. So if you want only the front end developer means, so you need to have knowledge on Angular, React, Vue, everything you need to have the knowledge. We need that money. One tutorial on React JS. 
means one tutorial on react.js i have only one tutorial on react.js we need to do redux toolkit uh, rtk queries these all things i need to work it out i will do those things also i am working as a developer manohar i am working as a developer in lnt technology services i have suggest i have suggested to my colleagues to follow your videos for rxjs yeah thank you manohar so rxjs is also one of the important things i have covered almost all the concepts in the rxjs so that is also if you are working as an angular development it is uh, must and should important for you to learn rxjs also why because angular heavily depends on rxjs that is the reason navin kumar npm trends view over the angular if i learn angular it's valuable or not so everything is valuable navin kumar so it's not a problem you can learn it so view view is very easy so you, there is nothing more in that view if you are, if you understand angular if you have knowledge in angular everything view will be very easy it's not that much of uh, hard within one month you can learn very easily and you can develop the application also mayank sati reactive forms have been the most difficult for me and integrating rxjs and ngrx with it okay yes yeah, so reactive forms is the uh, what i can say is that that way of coding the reactive forms is exclusively in the angular right so because of that one so we are not that much of accustomed to those things if react js and view js also supports this type of reactive forms and all the things then it will be easy for us but they have their own implementation and angular has their own implementation because of this thing so we are normal human beings right it's trend to forget those things it's not a problem so you practice it you will, you will understand blessing in this guys also in world projects for state management class components were used so you may not be working a fresh project so learn both okay lakshman samant how good should i be in javascript so javascript is very important lakshman so you should be very perfect in javascript i learned typescript and angular but in interview when i get question on js i am unable to answer should i go back to learn yeah it, it's sure so javascript so if you are work, if you are trying job for a front end or means javascript is very important try to understand the concepts in the javascript then only you can go for the framework if you don't understand the javascript thing so it's very difficult so it's also so many types of things will be there for example let's say that we have es 2021 so es 2021 will not support in the older browsers so what we need to do so in order to support these all things also i have covered in the javascript course es6 course and javascript course in my thing i think i covered in es6 course i think so try to understand these questions also they will be asking you in interview so for example if i have, if I have written the arrow functions let and constant in uh, the code and i want that code to work in the older browsers also so what can you do older browsers can able to understand these things right arrow functions let constant rest operators spread operators these all things i can able to understand class so what i need to do so these all things are very important so you will tell that angular does everything so angular does everything fine tomorrow angular if it is become commercial means then what you will try to do so you need to understand what is the things going on behind this one how that uh, browser is able to understand these all things so manohar i have good knowledge in angular but i want to learn react parallel how to proceed it's not a problem so you can directly the documentation is also very easily the react js documentation if you try to see it's very understandable and it's very simple uh, compared to angular react react documentation is very simple angular it is very difficult to uh go through the documentation and all the things so, so many things will be there whereas in react it's a straightforward we can learn it so uh, my course is also there right you can see my course so that's it so most of the time though that that course only will be there so we ha have covered the redux concept also in that react thing so you can understand <clears throat> not a problem sir do you, uh blessing do you ask this ago while taking interviews for purely front end yeah these all things i will be asking so if you are having uh, experience means so i will be asking these all the things javascript is the main thing i will be asking so i will go step by step in the interviews actually first i will i will go through the html then afterwards i will ask the css then i will go for the javascript then i will go for the framework which framework they have worked in the resume what they have mentioned i will ask and all at the last i will ask that uh, about the react view and angular difference what is the things you can find it meetsha can you also create one full course on azure developments 
I will try to do it meet uh, Asha. So it will it may take some time. Why? Because so many development uh, courses are the are there in the pipeline for me. Hojipa Mangalore Wala. So what is uh, Angular Universal? What is Angular Universal means? So uh, every project, what I can say, every framework has their own thing. For example, let's say that Angular you have an Angular Universal. For React you have a Next.js. For Vue.js you have a Nuxt.js. What is this actually does is uh, these are Angular, uh, React for while doing a single page applications. Those are not search engine friendly. So that means uh, if you try to see the page source, you will be able to, you will not see anything. HTML code will not be visible everything. So but what Angular Universal will do is in between this one a node server will be there which will run in the nodes are in the server and this node server will uh, render all the data all the html and it will throw it to the browser so for search engine friendly most of the time we'll be using angular universal and next js next js is somewhat advanced to combat angular universal we can also do this uh, single page application in this one so something like framework for a framework you can think for next and next js Manohar, any suggestions for Angular design patterns? Yeah, yeah, it's there for me. So in my bucket list also, I will, I will work on these things. What I can say is uh, Angular design. First, I will do the JavaScript design patterns and JavaScript. Uh, uh, some of the things most commonly solved problems. These all things I will do it. Then afterwards, we'll go for the Angular. Automatically, you can apply those things for Angular also. Not a problem. Yeah. So the HTML course, what I am trying to do right now also is important. So try to understand these things. So which element we need to use it in the real time. These all things are very important. So don't underestimate the course. HTML, okay, I know everything. So don't underestimate like that. So every video has some information. So you can gain some point in that one. So don't underestimate those all things. So try to learn it. Then you will understand, not a problem. So you don't think that any plan, uh, meet any plan for .NET for backend API no no bro so right now i am not planning for any dot net for actually a plan is there but right now i am not doing so why because these things only became so hectic for me to complete so dot net core and all those things means so i will be having a lot of headache on my head your angler please help me a lot lila thanks a lot sham Gaurav. thank you sham sandeep archery Sandeep Parchuri. I have watched reviews. Those are really good and you simply things very nicely. Thanks for that. Thank you, Sudeep. Bono, which framework best for React for learn base? Which framework best for React? React itself is a library, right? So for this one, a framework again. So you are asking me about Gatsby. These things, P React, Gatsby or Next.js. These things are you are asking me. B Navin Kumar, any plan to create DSA for your list? DSA means I didn't get you. Meet Shah. Thanks, Leela. Your angle is very good. Thank you, Meet. How many years did it take to have so much knowledge? Blessing in disguise. Actually, I have around uh, 10 years of experience. I already, I have already told you, right? So, I worked first at the back end. So, PHP I worked on. So, these all things. Later on, I shifted to Node.js. And then I am working right now in Angular. These all things. So, phase by phase, I have incrementally I went on. So uh, one thing what I can suggest is for the developers is you need to have the backend knowledge. Why? Because for the front-end developers, I used to see these people don't have the knowledge that the resp response types. For example, let's say the 404 is a not phone. 400 is a uh, bad request. So like this, 500 is an internal server error. That means any server side uh, code mistake is there means you will get a 500. These type of request header codes also, response header codes also, status codes also front-end developers cannot able to understand so you need to have knowledge on this back-end also if you are working as a front-end developer also you need to have knowledge on the back-end or otherwise if you are working as solely as a front-end uh, back-end also you need to have knowledge on the front-end so both are interrelated any back-end uh, code whether it may be a php or whether it may be a ruby either it may be python anything so you need to understand the basic how the in uh, web page works so how the web page works from getting response from sending request by the browser and getting response to the browser again what is the phase by phase what is happening how the server will execute the code and send the html to the browser so these are all the things the cycle you need to understand then only you will be able to work on the project that is the thing I, that is the suggestion i can give you directly working on this one what i can say is 
the backend people will give you the api url and you will make a post request or anything and you'll get the response and uh, you'll bind it to the template means that's not the thing everyone can do one year experience guy also can do those things patan sharuk khan thanks for it thank you patan data structures and algorithms so yeah these things only i'm telling right pa design pattern data structures javascript these all things i will do it so that's you it is easy to require to learn angular material and prime mg along with angular in real time yeah this angular material also is required a prime mg these two are uh, material backgrounds right is it is required so it is uh, depends on the uh, project so if any company you join they you can use the angular material or they can use the prime mg or otherwise they use the tailwind or uh, bootstrap itself so learning is uh, not bad right so we can learn it not a problem ravi danni hi leela i started watching nj i feel this is the best one in youtube thank you so much right help me a lot on the project yeah thank you ravi back end node js is good right yeah fine uh, manohar so for example let's say that my opinion so as i am a normal person i am not an i can't say that i am an intelligent guy like that rather than learning another new language okay so dot net or php or anything rather than learning another new knowledge and syntax and all those things i can suggest you that if you are a front end developer you are experienced in javascript you know all the syntax and everything in the javascript so is it it is it is fast enough for you to learn the node js it is a back end right and also the code everything will be in the javascript so whatever the things you implement in the front end you can implement in the node js also so rather than learning another dot net core or php or anything so node js you can learn means you can write the syntax syntax problems will not be there so in javascript you will write triple equal to and all those things in dot net the only double equal to will be supported so these types of things will be you will be confused so technology shifting so for that reason you can learn directly node js it will be very easy for us right so that is the thing i i uh, my suggestion i don't know so if you so what i thought was so instead of learning this in this small life instead of learning other other technologies one technology if you are perfect means fine we can do it how to start back end knowledge so patan how to start back end knowledge means so i i will be starting this soon back end uh, courses also so first we will learn about the databases mongo db i will start then afterwards we'll do the node js and all those things so i will start those all things also yes sir please sir please in react js practice on the index page okay like sidebar nav bar in content on one page or sidebar is fixed and i am unable to get yes actually your question like our best book for js actually i read very less of in the books and all those things i will read these all uh, javascript i used to read this mozilla developer to developer uh, md and will be there right mozilla development network i read that to do material only in night also i used to surf through the phone so books i will less often i will read absolutely agreed with your input learn node js if you are familiar with js yeah micha so that is the thing i can say is to instead of learning these all other frameworks and all those things if you are familiar in other other frameworks uh, what i can say in dot net core and java and all those things you can learn without any problem so if you are starting the back end means if you have knowledge in angular and javascript go for native node js not a problem so you need to understand the back end how the web works that is the main important then of course you can learn those all things sir please make video on dynamic react routing yeah yes sure i will try to make it so how much time it has been 40 okay so fine then people so this is our first live so i came for the first live so next onwards i will try to do it one hour so it's already 40 minutes or something like that this day today i got something problem in the thing so setting up this first live so next onwards i will not repeat this again so but hope you understood these all the things so what are the inputs i have given hope you understood these things so try to understand those all things so we'll meet next uh, live we'll meet again so we'll come with the course so now onwards what i will try to do is every weekend uh, what i can say every course uh, uh, every course after completion i will do the live i will try to do like that front end application security cover few videos okay sure sure i will cover so let's see not a problem uh, meet sha so i will be doing the css also after completion of this html so you can see my course i will cover all the concepts i will try to do it yeah
narayan ready hi and hello not fine i am i am fine narayan so bye guys then so we will meet again so next afterwards i will i will post you the update so live i will meet again thank you